Gymshark with their new Legacy range, new Ombre Seamless. Wow. Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. My name is Liz, if you haven't seen any of my videos before. And today I'm doing a gym clothes haul from Gymshark with their new legacy range and also I've got a pair of leggings from the new ombre seamless range so very very excited to try it all on I've not ordered stuff from Gymshark for a while so and when I seen the legacy range I was like yes it looks so good I am so excited to try it so I'm just gonna open it now and and figure out what I'm gonna try on first So here we have it, I'm just going to see what I want to try on first and I'll let you know. Okay, so I just have to say with this haul, with the Legacy range, because I've brought more items from the Legacy, um, there was a lot of things already out of stock and there was a specific pair of shorts that I wanted to get and it was completely out of stock in my size so I've just brought what I could from the range which I liked. So. Yep, let's get into the video. Okay, so the only legacy shorts that were available, um, still in stock and in my size, were these, which definitely look bigger than what I expected. Um, I am a medium in everything, so these these look big, quite thick. I'm gonna try these shorts on with the legacy crop tank in like a blue color. So this actually looks really nice. It's got kind of like a wide arm here, so won't be too tight so yeah i'll try these on first okay so first impressions the sizing seems a little bit big i always always order medium everywhere and always on gymshark and the size always fits me but with this the top feels big and baggy i thought it was going to be more of a softer skin like material but it isn't it's still really soft but it's definitely a thicker material and as we're in like coming up to the summer months you wouldn't think that bring out a range that is so like thick material and same with the shorts they are absolutely huge all of this spare material here I mean of course I could do with iron in it they are a bit big and I've done this up here they come here they go up and come round so you're not seeing any of your bum this is baggy yeah just i'm not a huge fan to be honest if you was into more oversized kind of baggy comfortable clothes then maybe this would be for you but personally it just feels a little bit thick a little bit baggy and there's definitely a lot of excess material in these shorts for a medium Clearly not the biggest fan. I mean, the shorts is just a big no from me. So big, thick material, baggy, not flattering at all. Um, the top's okay. I mean, it's just a basic crop top. You can't go wrong. I like the logo here and it's sewn into the material so that isn't gonna come off in the wash. But with the sizing, just being so baggy, I'm just not a fan. So hopefully the rest of these items are going to be good. Not good, not, not a good start. But yeah, I think the others will be nice. But anyway, moving on to the next outfit. I got the Legacy Fitness Leggings in black. And I got the Legacy Fitness Sweater in smoky grey. First impressions with these leggings, they are definitely feel more true to size as a medium. They've got more of a slick, soft feel to them. They feel like they've got a good stretch. The waistband seems firmer, so the waistband seems really good. Oh, they've got little pockets in the side here. Probably put your phone in. So yeah, I'm really liking the look of these. Just notice they've got a little bit of mesh detailing at the bottom. The sweater, it feels so 
like high quality it feels like just like a really nice thick material so i'm going to put these on next wow i am excited i first of all i absolutely love this outfit and did i just find a pair of black squat proof leggings I think I did. I'm so happy right now. You don't understand the amount of black leggings that I try from every single brand just to see if they're squat proof. I think they are anyway. So anyway, let's go through the outfit. Love this top. So you can make it tighter doing this. Feels just really like good, thick quality, like I said before, really flattering. I probably wear this more day to day rather than at the gym just because you know it's thicker and it's long sleeved. But I just really love the style of it. The logo is here at the front, sewn into the material. It just looks really nice. I love the colour and the way it comes in here because with some crop tops, if they're too baggy like this, they're not that flattering, so it's really good that you can just pull it in here at the waist. And the leggings. I don't know if you're going to be able to see properly. Um, because with black, it kind of doesn't really show as well on screen. But yeah, love them. So the logo is here at the back. We've got some detailing that comes. It's like that. So you've got like two seams that come here. And it gives you kind of like a booty contour but i don't know if you can tell on camera you've got mesh here but it's only i'm not really a big mesh fan but as it's only at the bottom i don't mind the waistband they're nice and firm they're not as firm as for example the energy seamless because they are very firm but they are still feel like they pull you in at the waist and very comfortable the material feels kind of like a second skin very slight sheer which i don't usually like i usually hate that in leggings but with these they just feel really nice I'm definitely a big fan of the legacy leggings and of course I love this light sweater top as well definitely recommend these leggings 100% and I did not think at all just didn't think I was going to love them as much as I do so very very happy about that so I've only got one more item to try on which I'm very excited about as this is the new adapt ombre seamless leggings in black mall first impressions they feel very firm, got a good stretch to them and the waistband is a little bit smaller. This is how big the actual waistband is. Feels really firm on the waistband. And you've got your usual normal Gymshark logo here. I love the colour. So yeah, let's put these on there. So I've just got them on now. They do take a bit of pulling up so they've got a good firm um, like support to them which is really good actually surprised they are similar um material to the legacy leggings even though these are the new ombre seamless i kind of expected more of a cottony stretchy material but it isn't here is what they look like so it's obviously all complete black on top going down to the ombre towards the leg here the logo is at the back here um it feels like not as high waisted there's a tiny little gap here i know you can't sit but there's a tiny gap here which feels a bit annoying so if i was going to go down they would kind of ride down at the back a little bit so that's a little bit off putting considering these leggings are 50 pounds i kind of expected better better quality they just feel not great and i have to say these are not Quite proof because I've already checked in the mirror. I mean, they're really pretty, and I would, you know, I'd probably wear them for upper body day. But being realistic, I would not be able to wear these for a leg day. Yeah, these are definitely true to size, but I just feel like I would kind of be pulling them up like this a little bit and move the back, kind of having a little gap here. It's just a little bit off putting.
they are a nice legging and I do like them and like I said I would probably have to wear them for upper body days but personally for me they're not worth the price um, the other leggings were cheaper and in my opinion they were much better so if I had to go with one I would go for the legacy ones I think with these leggings they just don't have the amount of stretch that the other leggings do like with the legacy leggings I know they had a bit of a sheerness to them which so do these as well surprisingly but they feel like they have more stretch and like you can really move around in them jump around and you'll be fine whereas these are lacking the same amount of stretch that they have so that is definitely a bit off-putting and the way that they kind of fall down slightly if you was to bend down doing exercises it just feels not the most comfortable leggings ever and i really had high hopes of these leggings i thought i was going to love them but I just don't love them but they're still nice they look pretty they're very flattering very firming but just not the best leggings ever from Gymshark so yes that is my full review of these leggings so favorite items of course the black legacy leggings and this uh, sweater if you was gonna buy anything from this range 100% get them leggings. I'm just so blown away that they're actually squat proof and they, you know, they're high waisted, they're very flattering, they look good, they're just so comfortable, perfect for leg days and any day. So, yeah, I have to say, definitely my favourite by far. So, that is actually everything that I brought this time. Not the biggest haul. I usually buy more items when I do a clothes haul, but there was just not loads of things in stock, and if they were, they were not in my size. So, yes, anyway, that brings me to the end of the video. So, I regularly record gym clothes hauls, so if there's any brands that you want me to review, just drop it in the comments, as I am always looking for different brands to review make sure to like and subscribe as that really supports me and my channel i upload every monday and thursday so i will see you next time